Good day, fellow learners. Once again, this is your mentor, your fact check by the Ray Gapples, joining you for our case discussion for case number 21. So, on to our goal for the day. So, I'd like to make this request. Please join us in this mission. Our goal is to provide free MPLEX RN application and interview to 100 nurses. We actually have increased the scholarship grants to 300 nurses this year. And to help us achieve this, just watch and finish the ads in our videos. And share this video to at least 10 of your friends and we'll pray for your success. That's going to be the Ray Gapos team praying for your success. Share this now. And I'd like to say thank you to this anonymous donor who gave up 20,000 pesos for our scholarship grants. Thank you so much. And to the other anonymous donors who don't want their names or their good deeds to be mentioned here, I know God will bless you. So let me first begin with this public advisory that Dr. Ray A. Gapus, that's me, and the mentors of the Ray A. Gapus system are not part of another center named Gapus Review Academy or Gapus Review. So if you don't see any one of us in your class, that's not a Ray Gapus system class. And we actually have our promo for this year. Get a free review from us if you process your NPLEX RN application with ITAPS GAPUS. So let me greet Justine P. Tiong, who passed the New York Board of Nursing last June 12, 2024, and she processed her application through ITAPS, the processing arm of the Ray GAPUS system. Thank you, ITAPS GAPUS and Ray GAPUS Review System for not giving up on me. I took my exam last June 12, 2024 reached the maximum number of questions and finished at 150. After 85 questions, the computer did not shut down. Pop your shoulder, okay lang yan. At 100, it still did not close. Tachycardic, then at 120 to 130, it still keeps coming. Hopelessness, guys, don't be intimidated. Focus, strategize, and breathe. All the concepts have been taught by Sir Ray, the 10 days face-to-face, -face, three days and online reviews, 311 Books has been very helpful. Just trust the system. You will be the next to tell your story. Once again, my heartfelt thanks to all that helped me achieve who I've become at this point in time. So salute to Shastin. And remember at ITAPS GAPUS, we process your NPLEX application faster and at a more affordable cost because our package starts at 45,000 and that includes a free, free review program. So. On to our next generation NPLEX are in case number 21, and this is going to be moniliasis. But before that, let me congratulate the batch 2023 from Pangasinan State University who posted 100% passing rate. Look, guys, they just graduated last year, and in a span of less than a year, they all passed their next generation NPLEX RN. So congratulations to Liza Joyce Alakdis. Sherna Pinzon, and of course, um, the two other passers from the batch. So congratulations, and may your tribe increase. Okay, so once again, the batch 2023 of PSU who passed, Sherna Pinzon, Liza Joyce B. Alakdis, Eunice Faith B. Bueno, and Elizabeth Corpus. My hats off to, you, to all of you colleagues. They posted 100%. Okay, now on to our NPLEX RN alert, moniliasis. Now, this is a yeast infection. It's caused by a fungus called Candida albicans, usually occurring before menstruation. Now, Candidiasis could also occur in the mouth. So in some clients, they have oral candidiasis, especially those who are using inhalers when um, they're having asthma attack. That's why it's very important that they have to use spacers and do the swish and spit method after using an inhaler. That would definitely decrease the incidence of fungal infection. So this is manifested by thick white cottage cheese-like discharge. So that's the characteristic manifestation. Pay particular attention to that. White cottage cheese-like discharge. And this occurs immediately before menstruation. That's why the choice of sanitary pad is important. Choose the sanitary pad that's not scented so that the chemicals will not irritate the area. And possibly you can choose the sanitary pad with wings 
or not just the wings, but with bird. <laughs> of course, that's a joke. I'm just kidding. The wings and the bird in the sanitary pad. Now, monoliasis is common among the following. Remember, choppy, catheter users, hospitalized individuals, those who are using hormonal birth control pills that potentially increases the estrogen, and this also occurs during pregnancy, the increase in estrogen causes hormonal imbalance that could potentially increase the risk for developing your yeast infection. For pregnant individuals, once again, because of the hormonal change, people with dentures and diabetes, well, especially if the diabetes is not controlled, and for young individuals, your babies and children who usually have an immune system that have yet to mature. So monoliasis is manifested by pain and soreness in the vagina, itching, which is like vaginal discharge, painful intercourse and urination, irritation in the vagina, and change in vaginal color from pale pink to red that signifies irritation. Remember, the code monoliasis is manifested by pink. <laughs> okay, so let's move on. So uh, monoliasis is treated with echinocandines like your caspofungine and anidulafungine. Now remember your echinocandines can also potentially cause uh, gastrointestinal irritations, nausea, vomiting, diarrhea, and they can potentially cause hepatotoxicity and thrombolevitis. So it's very important that the clients are told about these potential adverse and side effects. And of course, it could also be treated with antifungal creams, ointments, tablets, suppositories like your terconazole, tioconazole, and of course, your clients could also be asked to take metronidazole. Now, what are the things that you have to remember with metronidazole? Sometimes, Four tablets of 500 milligrams are given to the client. And they have to take it all at once with a glass of water. And this could potentially cause the brownish discoloration of the urine. And it's important for the nurse to reassure the client that it's not a cause for alarm. Okay. So um, some doctors would prefer to give uh, the metronidazole um, two doses in one day and then give it in a period of 10 days. But some would definitely give it with four tablets and given all at once, okay? With a glass of water. Let's now move on to um, those who are asking me which pages of the book, NCLEX RN311, would you need to focus on? I've enumerated them here. Please do revisit these pages that I have placed here. And I asked Tessa, one of our passers, what part of our review helped you the most? Dr. Ray Lahat Po from Compre Bootcamp, Quick Fix Pharma, Pharma Book 311 NRS. And of course, doctor, your YouTube videos, inaabangan ko palagi. So you may want to follow that success recipe. Okay, so here's our case number 21, okay? 27-year-old female seeks consult for burning on urination and non-foul-smelling whitish curd-like vaginal discharge that she describes as light cottage cheese. Which of the following factors could have contributed to the client's condition? Okay, the question is, could have contributed? And you don't have a diagnosis. So you think through the symptoms that were provided, like having the cottage cheese-like discharge could mean the client could be suffering from monoliasis, okay, or candidiasis. So could this be related to decreased estrogen levels? We talk about elevated estrogen levels, not decreased. Use of scented sanitary pads, we can consider that is irritating. Changing use of, sorry, controlled diabetes mellitus, it should be uncontrolled diabetes mellitus. Changing to dry clothes immediately after a long gym time, no, that would definitely help prevent the development of um, candidiasis. So the answer to this question is the use of scented sanitary pads, okay? So may I invite you to join me in my 10-day challenge, Quick Fix Bootcamp, that's going to be done on Mount Crest Hotel in Baguio City. The sessions begin from 8 a.m. to 6 p.m. on November 13 to 24. That's going to be a 10 days 
high yield class with me and of course with some guest mentors. So join our hundreds and thousands of passers from more than 30 countries worldwide who benefited from the Ray Capos system. And remember, here at our system, you learn how to study with technology as our tools are published by world-renowned publishers. And we have our own learning management system that is being updated every month. And of course, most importantly, we have a very conducive learning environment. We have our own simulation room for Next Generation and FlexRN. And we keep our class size to a manageable, comfortable level. So may I invite you to join me in our NPLEX RN Flex, the most flexible test prep class for the next generation NPLEX RN, your choice of live face-to-face -face class, live virtual class, on-demand and limited video recorded lessons, QBank and the three books, NGN strategies and sample questions, and then the quick fix sessions. Once again, our fee starts at 3,499, including the three books. So if you want to pass the test the easy way, do it the Ray Gapus way. So once again, this is your mentor, your fact check by the Ray Gapus saying good luck to those who are about to take the test. And for those who intend to join me in the bootcamp, see you at the summer capital of the Philippines, Baguio City. Take care and God bless.